many Americans will not make it to work the day after the Super Bowl. There was one survey last year that put it around 19 million, either people that are going to call out or show up late. That would be one out of five workers thereabouts. Uh, there was another survey that was out this year that put it around 16 million. But again, it depends on who's calling out and who's showing up late. And there are some lawmakers in the state of Tennessee let me go ahead and pull this up, that have a proposal to turn Super Bowl Monday into an actual holiday in their state. Two Democrat lawmakers introduced a bill this week that would make the first Monday after the Super Bowl a holiday in Tennessee. To make that happen, though, the state would have to get rid of another holiday. So the lawmakers are proposing to scrap Columbus Day. (laughs) So what do you think about this? Should the day after the Super Bowl, because 200 million Americans apparently tune in to the Super Bowl, would it be smart to say, you know what, we're going to have a late start to the day. We could take it, take the day off completely. Should you have to replace another holiday or transfer another holiday? Do you have to do that exchange or could we just sort of decide to do it? Is it wise for a company to do it or for our children's schools to do it? I did notice I was one of them a little bit later to drop off this morning. So is there some wisdom in this? I just wonder that. That'll be a question I'll leave up to you today. 